It was originally effective the end of this year, but I have spoke to the clerk today and asked her to move it up to the 8th of December because we are replacing Doug Penny who's moving out of the township and it's a good time to just do it all and get it done, get them signed in office and be ready to work towards the new year. I just felt it was best all the way around. At first I couldn't resign right away because of lack of st uh, counsel. Uh, Heather, as you know, has been off ill and has gone through surgery. Good news is she's well, coming back well. Good news is good health and um, I'm very happy about that. And uh, we know Doug has to move away because they've decided to do, buy a new home elsewhere. But as I said, without quorum, I couldn't resign within that time frame between now and the 8th of December. So I said I'd stay longer. But now that Heather's coming back to council, then I have the opportunity to get out and let the new person take over. It's not an easy thing to do. It's been very difficult. It was one of the worst things I've had to do is make that decision. I love my job, I love working with people and the politics, but my health has to be put first. I've tried this last year to get out of the stress mode that causes me my health issues. So I have decided that I had to do it. I have to put Barb first now. I want to be around a little while longer with, my kids are all concerned, my doctor told me to quit a year ago. so. And in terms of that, I mean, I'm sure the people of Chisholm are quite concerned. You have done some really good work um, as as the mayor of Chisholm and, and you know, fighting to get what, what is necessary for the well, area. Most don't know. Um, it's really not right out there in the public knowledge. The Omegwin News knows because they got a copy of the agenda when I submitted my letter of resignation. So the bulk of the people aren't, but I know the councillors are planning some type of a a little get-together in November and uh, our Christmas dinner is on the 4th of December for staff and council so I will be done on the 8th if that can be done with Heather coming back. What do you say to the folks that um, voted you in and, and, and wanted you to, to be on for, the, the, for, the, for your term? I know. Well, I say I guess I'm sorry that I can't keep going. Um, I should have been done a year ago with the heart attack, but I really tried to do, put my people first. They're my number one aim in this job, is to work for them and make sure everybody treat, is treated the same. That's been one of my big pushes. Um, we have a great township here, it, and it's beautiful, and I want to keep it that way. But we certainly needed repairs to bridges and roads, and I've been fortunate to you know, get to know the, the political higher powers and work with them. And um, beg, borrow, or steal, they call me the bridge lady, but we did receive a lot of funding and much of it didn't have to be paid back. So uh, I'm happy. I, I'm pleased with the work I've done. And uh, the way our budget is now, I don't think we're going to be pursuing any big things next year. But I leave it to the people that are sitting, whoever's going to sit in my chair. And that will be decided this fall, like in December. So.